Hey guys, in this video I will talk about the air conditioning system of the car. First off, in this video I will be refilling my system with gas and I will tell you a few tips. Most of cars today are equipped with AC systems, manual or automatic. The most important thing you should know as a car owner is that the coolant, which in most of the cases is freon, becomes corrosive over time and it needs to be replaced in a car workshop. You should check your AC system once every two years. Refill if necessary and replace the oil of the compressor. The compressor needs 10 to 20 grams of oil to work properly. If you neglect this, the compressor will get damaged in a few years and it costs over $200 to replace. Also, the Freon itself will destroy the tubes from the system and you might need to change the AC radiator or tubes. For my A3 I need 525 grams of Freon and I'm using a Texa 760R device for the operation. It takes around 25 minutes. The first step is to connect the hoses to the device. The blue one is for the low pressure valve and the red one is for the high pressure valve. Some cars come with only one valve, whether they're for high pressure or for low pressure. This device sucks out the old Freon and it checks the vacuum and if there are any major leaks in the AC system. If it finds any leaks, it won't recharge with fresh gas. If everything is just fine, it will pump in fresh gas. However, the device won't see tiny holes, but we can track them with the help of a UV substance. The cost of the operation isn't too high, it's around $35 in Romania. Now, a quick guide for those who might have problems with the AC system. If all of a sudden the AC isn't working, check if the compressor engages. If it does, but you can't feel any cold air, you might have run out of gas. If you have Freon but still no cold air, it means that the compressor or the fans are not working. It's pretty simple to solve any problem with the AC system, but in some cases it can be expensive. I just finished the AC operation, now let's see if we have any cold air. If you have any questions regarding the AC system, leave them down below. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more car videos and I'll talk to you guys soon.